Hey y'all, welcome back to the Lip Smacker channel. I'm Lips and today we have our finale episode of The Wolf Among Us. Telltale blew this game out of the park. Out of the water, out of the park? I don't know what that saying is. Not quite sure, but here it is. Here we are, we're at the finale. And on episode four, we left on quite the cliffhanger. So we have a couple of things to figure out, some things to ponder, the crooked man to converse with more, and we have a little dilemma, a big dilemma to solve in the world of Fable Town. So thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. I'm Lips and it means the world that you have shared in the experience and the story of The Wolf Among Us. I can't wait for The Wolf Among Us 2 to come out later this year. So when it does, make sure you pop back in because we definitely will be playing it. Also, do you have any other Wolf Among Us games that you recommend? The Banishers comes out next week, which is a game that I have been excited for since I saw a trailer for it. I think a year and a half ago maybe I'm not quite sure I do if I recall correctly my reaction to that trailer is live on this channel so I am looking forward to diving into that game next starting next week in place of the wolf among us but if you're interested in more telltale games here I would be interested in playing them I've got my eyes on um the Walking Dead series. Yeah, that, the Walking Dead Telltale game. Are you interested? When you come back for that, let me know. Okay? Um, otherwise, there's other links down below where you can find me, but don't go there yet. Let's stay here. Let's play the game. Let's get back to Big B and the team. Also, to the person who said that I wanted to be in the middle of a blue beard, um, hold on, let me read it exactly because you were so true you were so right you said someone really wants to be in a woody bluebeard sandwich muldoni 6920 i do your honor i am guilty <laughs> thank you for noticing let's get into the game I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Oh. Hi, Faith. Miss you. <sighs> what if Faith isn't it. dead? What if they had someone glamoured as Faith? Wait. Hmm. Did anyone else do the Lily? I just don't know what Big B's doing. If he if he cares about it, if he even gives a shit. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the river. I think he gives it? a lot of shits, but we're destroying the tree. No. We're not we didn't end up tree, destroying so. it. I still don't know You're if I regret really that decision or not. Farm, are you? Look, no, Colin. Maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that to you. Oh God, Big B! Bloody Mary. No joke. Your ass. Metal shellings as you see fit to take just one more silver round near your heart. And the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Big B, wait. When you get the I know we've heard that before, but I'm sure like that. It's just a reminder, a he scary reminder. Trying. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that is where we pick up today, y'all. It's the Wolf Among Us. It's me. It's you. It's Big B. It's Woody. It's Bluebeard, it's Snow. Bloody Mary. The Crooked Man. You know, it's like... Who's the real wolf among us? 
Who is it? Is it really Big B? It's not Big B. I don't, what if it was all along? What, what if it was all along? Cry wolf. Oh, baby. What the fuck? You must be tired. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Hmm, silver bullets near the heart. That's the end of us. I really would like Please to not get Big B killed forever. For a moment, will you? How can I relax? Your friend has a gun out. Wait, who is that woman? Want to drink? Something to eat? From you? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. We're not friends. It's really a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. Don't misunderstand the situation here. We are not friends. You're in no position to offer me anything. On the contrary, Sheriff. And I don't wish to contradict you here. But your initiative and mine have been friendly for a long while now. Ever since I came aboard these shores. You know, Fable Town's been very accommodating of my humble ventures. What? Never said a bad word. Just what are you talking Rain, about? Rain, you mean? I've just been left in relative peace. I think it puts it best. Allowed to live my own way. And that's gonna stop. And why? And why did they let you do that? What do you think you're doing? What He's the gonna, hell, Mr. Wolf dude? Is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. Okay. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. Okay, crooked man. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you? Oh, we smoke the same here? cigarettes, it huh? Help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You killed those women. You know why? killed those women is there Walter, anything else we care about faith and lily i mean the I'm girls who worked at the pudding and pie did i now i assume by your confidence in accusing me you must have some proof of this yes what an Someone annoying response a witness perhaps hmm? oh i should have said something but i don't know i thought not but that's okay those women, we don't have any evidence telling you that the killings were perpetrated by an employee of mine so you were involved of business, and you knew about it. You, but the business? Be with internally. Biz I just want to settle the issue for you and to assure you that it's over with. Then who did it? Fortunate bit of business. You're going to tell me right now who killed him. Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your... The other option was that we know who did it? But I simply can't divulge that information. But like, someone who hires a hitman gets you accused really of murder. Really yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it right now. Mine. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation. Um. The man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? Hit him? Ooh, Please. you're pissing me off. Just sit, use our, use your words right now. We are off. hurt. You don't want to make it worse. <sighs> you think I'm scared of you? <laughs> you're nothing more That's than a enough. Man. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but in the interest of preserving our alliance, if you have to know, it was Georgie. However, like I said, he just I gave us that information willingly. George, I do mind. You got what you wanted, so just sit. Jersey, down sit your ass down. Now. Why did Georgie do it? Did you tell him to do it? I killed him, so what? What do you mean, so what? You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. Why? Why'd you do it? Why kill them? Does it matter? Look. Uh, greatly. Is, yeah. George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So. Well, what exactly what did out. you say, fucking man? Out. I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this. And then you attempt me to, to kill blame him. me for it. Huh. You will be silent. Actually, Cooked Man, thank you so much for speaking up. Thank you so much for speaking up because this. now I realize that you really were the puppeteer master. So what do you say, and he's Can just your puppet. Terms? 
You can have Georgie. No. Consider it a gift. I'll I'm take sure you both. Our continued cooperation. I think I'll be taking both of you. You're not taking me, you fucking punts. What the fuck is this shit? Well, you said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You can't give a fuck if I'm the one who the shit do you think you fuckers are the fuck out of here? Oh, I've started a fight sheriff, amongst the masses. If you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. No, I'm not leaving. You can go join that hole at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit. But he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? I'm running out of patience, crooked man. I don't have time to fuck around here. Hot. This could have Smash. gone so well. Could it have? But you just could it really have? Things. Could it really have gone well? To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. No. Why negotiate when you can just decide? You lit you spoke so much and made. Why can she control mirrors like that? Why can she do that? Did I miss anything good? Um. Well, look at you all fixed up. She scares me. <gasps> Shit. Oh, well. Is that really the one I wanted to go after first? I don't know. I don't know. Take this! <gasps> ah! Whoa! Frick! Nope! Fuck, 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 fuck him. Oh shit, what the hell? Glad to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad have... to see your insides turned out. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, hell yeah! Which one did I get? Do you down? Go after them. Go after them into whatever portal they just went into. <gasps> run, Bigby, run! No, oh, you don't need to kill the other one. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, wasn't even in his mind. Come on. Oh, shit. I know. I know. Beginning of the end. Oh, shit. Now it's a different place. Pardon me? Pardon me? Hey. Oh, correct. Do I have control of anything? Can't tell. Oh, we just look at that's our distance meter, I think. Good boy, good boy. No? Oh, shit. There they are. There they are, baby boy. There they are. You got this. You got this. Oh, yeah. Gaining some ground. Shit. Woo, oh, shit. What was that? I don't know. What was it? Oh, the crooked man was right there in the limo. I can't. I don't even think. 
Stinky, 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 stinky move. Maybe now we'll catch the limo. Ooh. Me thinks. Are we running out of time or are we getting closer? Hey! Nope. Wrong car. Gun it. Are you sure? Do it. Jump, 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 jump. He's not moving. Keep going. Hmm. Hmm. I have a feeling we're getting a bad ending, guys. Back at the club. Probably was so easy for him to kill them too. Because they probably trusted him enough, you know? Wait, what? Hmm. I don't really understand what I'm supposed to see there. Holy shit. That is a lot of blood. Come on. We can't stay here. Uh, hang on. I need a minute. Okay. Let's listen. She seems to care about him. And I was I just listening. <sighs> Crooked man's the one you want. He is, you're of right. Course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. That it, Sheriff. I'm taking you in, Georgie. Let's go. <sighs> you're gonna carry me? Please, Sheriff. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. Why are you He's protecting dying. him? You can't seriously want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. Mm. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're he, dead. No, Crooked Man Look, is still I the know reason. We made a few mistakes. We all have. What? He made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Does she that is. Bother you? Even a little knowing that man murdered. Of course it does. Girls, so it's all my fucking fault then. I you fucking. Ah, Shit. You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf too. You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? I did what I had to. You can't fucking blame me for that. Then why did you do it? Why'd you do it then, huh? If it's not your fault, then what the fuck happened? <sighs> Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them. And then he fucking sold me out. The and both of you can go rot in hell. Georgie, you think I'm you the one to fucking blame? Still did. Still the one who pulled the trigger. Nobody held your hand and made you go through with it. Ryan, believe what you want. Look, I'm just mad at the, the crooked man. Doesn't matter if it's fucking true or not. I do feel like I played this wrong. I don't feel like I played go it the ahead, true the way that I wanted to. But it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. I want you to help me get crooked man. It must be so easy being. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. I Job's just can't tell right. I'm being gassed so and manipulated. It's all his fucking fault. No, shut up. Stop oh. having your fucking pity party. Oh. Well, what I was just... I supposed to do? Mm. You don't know what it's like, Bigby. Stop How whining. You know? Stop complaining and take responsibility for what you did. You murdered Faith and Lily. You put those fucking ribbons around their necks. You had the power to let him go, but you chose not to. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them... Then what? What would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. 
So you tell me if free Lily meant she had to die. Do you still think I had a fucking choice? What, what are you, you talking about? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep our girls quiet. To ensure absolute discretion. I promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But her you know what head. happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? We were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't Those were your me. ribbons? You're not innocent here either. <sighs> Wait. Those were your ribbons? You're in on this? Whoa. I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand. Nobody was supposed to die. That's what they all way. say. It, it was just a stupid idea. A gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. That's how it started anyway. This was supposed to be our place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. Then the crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... If you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her then. Mm. What no. are you doing? Break the spell. Save the fucking day. I'm Stop not. It. I'm not playing this game, Georgie. I won't kill her. Here Don't he is. talk about me like but I'm won't. not even here. Please. Fair. You think this is hard for you? My life is such a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't I get a say? It's my life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. I, I said I'm not doing it. I'm not gonna kill you. I know that. Wait. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just do what they want with my life. Ooh. I thought it would be different here. Embrace that power. Fucking sick. Vivian, I didn't mean. Do you think I wanted to be this person? What I did to Faith and Lily, to all of them. Vivian, wait. I Aww, every day is this I a love story Gwen between them? The and pretend I don't care. Mm, how sad I for have them. to forget what I've done to them. What I took away from them. Why did you do Narissa, it, though? And I hate myself. Vivian. I can't pretend anymore. What are you <gasps> doing? Vivian. Vivian. Don't. Uh, Vivian. Georgie. No. Fuck. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Why do you have to do that, Vivian? Oh no. Vivian. Shit. Damn Sorry. it. Okay, that sounded self centered. That damn it. it. Sounded like, damn, my lead. Vivian, instead of I like, I didn't fucking oh, no. mean it. I was just. Oh. And now we have zero leads. Oh. Get up. <gasps> Whoa, no mercy. Get up. Don't think so. No big mercy. <gasps> Holy shit. I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just yeah. make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Do you have any leads before I go? Really fuck him up for me, alright. He's gonna have it worse. Don't worry. I feel bad. Good. I really played that Old wrong. Foundry by the river. All right. My Shepherd metal works. Thank He'll you. Be there. Fucking asshole. My true goal and intention wasn't to kill Georgie. Or do you plan to kick me around a little first? No, I do not plan to. One by one. That's what you want to do, right? That's not. No. That's not who I am. Prove it then. No more games, all right. We both know how this ends. <laughs> You're literally dying in front of me. Your girlfriend is dead next to you. Just what? make it quick. I know what I did. <laughs> oh. uh, okay. All right, Georgie. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, Georgie. Oh, Georgie.
big bad wolf. I really had intended to play it like, just I need you for, but like, I kind of wanted it to be like, okay, I'm taking you both in. <sighs> when really the crooked man was my true desire, because he's the true baddie, but it's just so, so much more complicated than it should have been. Let's go get him. Of course. <sighs> Did I mess up? Packages. So mm. this is where they've been sending these. Oh, I wonder if we could have walked and learned anything from the car earlier. Knock knock. Ooh, lights turned on. Mary. All right, how are we gonna play this, Big B? You used to be something. Bitch, please. Still am. <gasps> Was this all a personal attack? That's faith. Faith in Nerissa? Faith in us? Snow? Faith, Nerissa. Snow and Big B and just Big B. What's this? They used to fear you. They'd hide anywhere. Now they just kind of hate me. Shivering bodies were just kind of sad. I feel like, like the big me we know, like this guy, if he had a Tinder profile, it would be like, I like a neat glass of whiskey on the couch. I like to watch Breaking Bad. Maybe I read a little John Kerouac. That's his name? No, not John Kerouac. John Grisham? What's that book guy who writes the books the dads read? Yeah. He reads like John Grisham and you know, he's just like... Also, will hold your hand in public. And he'll stroke your head and he'll give you a forehead kiss. Like that's the big B I know. He wears like a smoky cologne, but it's not too overpowering. It's kind of like, you know, I just, he'll take you to the movies, but he'll also take you to a nice Italian dinner. He'll buy you flowers. He'll only bite if you ask. You know, people hate him. They hate him because because they were once afraid of him and I feel like now they're no longer afraid of him. And so instead of being afraid, their fear turned into hate. Silver. 
Silver bullets. The big bad wolf. Grab those bullets. Can we grab those bullets? <gasps> it's about time you showed up. That scream came from literally so inside my lungs it coughed it out. That's nice. Girl. Ah, Bigby. I see you made it here in one piece. I do apologize, but I have some business to attend to. I leave you in the capable hands of my associate. Come find me when you finish. You know what is Don't more worry. annoying than someone who Get fights up front now. righteously? Someone who just worse. has other Aww. people do all his dirty Doesn't work for him. Me. I'm sure you'll persuade him. <laughs> I'm talking to hey, you. I'm talking to you. Didn't All right, we have to find a way to get on top of this situation. Oh, was she too busy fucking whatever breeze drifted through town? Oh, come on. Damn it, Bigby. Is that the best you can do? Okay. I don't like her invisibility powers why she just purr growl at us she's playing with us she's taunting us we need to be careful you know what bitch if you want us so badly why don't you come to us why did i come up here I didn't realize I was gonna, I thought I was gonna look at this situation, though. Do I need to walk? Hmm. It's dangerous up here. get somewhere safer <gasps> damn it she still gets us even though we hit it oh I didn't get that one where are you come out and face me yeah behind you behind you behind you <laughs> yo her true form is so <laughs> oh that's why she can come out of me duh that's why she has that little power. <laughs> God damn it, Lips. Do you know anything about Bloody Mary? What are you? The lover of the devil? What is your skin glowing like that? Get her into that? Streets, wolf in the sheets. It's like we're in the sheets. Probably the one that was glowing, so the one right in front of us. Show her you're the big bad wolf. 
She's a monster. She is tearing your shit. What the hell? There's another form? There's a, there's a, there's a, there's a stronger big bee, bad wolf? What the hell? <gasps> oh! Oh my god. Yikes. Right there. Ah! Max for Big B. And he'll puff and he'll blow your house down. human big bee form what yo whoa we break her mirror <gasps> that shot that was cool that was a cool cool shot <laughs> sorry do we <laughs> Stop looking at his schlong! He was butt ass naked! <laughs> Hello, Bigby. Good man likes Tired? Bigby. Give me one good reason not to rip you apart right now. This gun holds six rounds of. I won't miss next time. Okay, so he's five more rounds. Me, I thought I should point out a few things. Snow White wants you to bring me back to the woodlands, doesn't she? And that's what I want. Snow's not here. You're dealing with me now. Oh, maybe we should have played true, close to the bag there. I'm against defying your new boss, or at least for the time being. You will bring me back alive. God damn it, your I don't... All I ask for is the chance to speak for myself in front of the community. What? And I'm sure Miss White would agree that I should be given a fair trial. She would. Can we at least agree on that? Why do you I want will that? will have a trial. The whole town will be calling for your execution. Why would you want me to bring you back there? Why don't you let me what worry about that? What power? What insight? Look, what does no he have here? Why does he have leverage? That's funny. Why does he don't think he has leverage? This is just a precaution. In the public I'm opinion. Sure I'm no murderer, Mr. Wolf. You I didn't kill enable Rosemary. murdering. And I think you know that. All I'm no. asking for is a chance to explain my side of the story. Then what are you? You're not a killer? Then what are you? I'm a businessman, not a killer. There's still a lot you have to answer for. Nauseating and answer. I will, as long as you agree to my terms. Because I'm not saying another word until I'm brought before the community. And I don't think I'm being unreasonable. If you decide to do something stupid, like murder me, you won't get your answers. But you will have a difficult time explaining yourself to Miss White and the rest of this miserable town. You're often reckless. And I worry you're not thinking of the... Let me ask you another 
honest question. What do you really I do want to think about white. I do want to think about Snow White. Do you really want the truth? Or do you just want to look like the hero? Because those are two very different things. It's about faith. I'm doing this for faith. Because she and Lily died. And someone is going to answer for that. Then why are you here? You know who murdered them. Well, that still doesn't answer the whole why of it all. And I don't He's think... dead, isn't he? Yeah, but even if he wasn't dead, I would still be coming for Delta. you. You've won. You really think I'm that stupid? I understand you have an obligation to bring me in. But you can brighten up a little. It's over. So, shall we get going? Fine. Let's go. Let's right, get you to Snow White. Go. You're right. Hand over the gun. Snow White does want you. Hold on to it, if you don't mind. I mind greatly. Getting on mind greatly. I'm sure Miss White will be pleased. Such a reliable pup. I understand just cuff him. Want to keep you around. No. You're under arrest. You can't hurt us you just because we are agreeing to do what <clears throat> Snow did. Because it's not, we're not doing it because you asked for him. Be, you, because you reminded me that Snow did beg us to bring you back alive. And you know what? I don't want to disappoint her. Because it undermines her power we too. To do something. Are you that's not very chivalrous. Are you sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to. He's back. <gasps> the crooked man. Thank God. Motherfucker. Hell yeah. Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble. At the crooked man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. Yeah, what can happened? you see my face? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know. But I didn't kill him? I'm just glad you made it back in one piece. It's about time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes, what are you waiting for? You killed Lily. She was my sister. Oh, could what you? do you have to say for Where yourself? the fuck do you get this off? You think you have the right and to just do this to people? You're a fucking crook. This? What does he have to yes. say for himself? Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder of As Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not Georgie me. Georgie Porgy? What? It was Georgie? Georgie. I don't mean to interrupt you, You Ms. gave White. the order. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who okay. killed my sister? Well, We're where getting is it? ahead of ourselves. You're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? He's yeah, dead. Sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel Shit. now? Shit, we're gonna get in trouble for killing him. Out there? I sincerely hope not. Well, where is he? Sheriff? I Let's just say him. it. He's dead. He's... Well, what? Maybe we shouldn't have said we killed him. You so know what? You see, the culprit has been punished. Nope. There's no that doesn't change anything. We'll deal with it later, but right now, you're the one I'm concerned with. You I was handling this much better than I did. Clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. And I, I don't... Told I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? If you'd wait a moment. Let her finish. Then you can have your say. Got it? If you Snow insist. appreciates that. Hell yeah. <clears throat> you are charged with the murder of Faith Got to let this is her first Georgie big carried out on your order. Moment in this position. Got to let her have her moment. of the Fable Town community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. Aiding and providing monetary support for the forced prostitution at the pudding and pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And resisting now, arrest. Oh shit, we just didn't like say anything. There was, all those answers were so hmm. good. The prick one was sure. really fun. I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily. <sighs> this is what you wanted to come here and say? Oh, shit. Like hell you Stop didn't. the charade. 
We know you're so don't let him speak. Everyone just shut up for a minute. Let him get out his bullshit. Want a chance to talk? Well, go ahead. What? We all know he's guilty. What the fuck does he need to speak for? Wanna, everyone want to hear what he has to the say. The crooked man has committed crimes against this government and, most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death. Upon which your body will be committed to the witching where it fucking belongs. That's so right. let's get but on with it. We promised you a chance to defend yourself. So let and him finish speaking. What the fuck? Really justice. If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap mm. judgments, no more secrets. We are going to treat everyone fairly, even when they don't deserve it. Okay, Snap. She's got this that power. Ridiculous. I think we should keep him cop. But okay. He doesn't need his hands to talk. You have the floor. Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. Oh, I hate Don't it even more now that he has his hands. He was. Jesus Christ. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you gonna get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with it. This is fucking bullshit. He's always been a bit of a powder keg. Georgie seemed pretty convinced he didn't have a say in the wonder if I would have kept Georgie alive. My intention. Really? I would never authorize such an act. Any of you actually Baloney. believe this bullshit? No. Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? No! I was willing to cooperate. Yeah, and your goons attacked me. Did you forget that part? They get a bit carried away sometimes. You are responsible for that! They do you are responsible for that! You stood up in your little tower and watched! You could have told Mary to stop! even give up an innocent <sighs> just to save someone you better have I really a point you're going somewhere with this i see you want to cut right to the point i can appreciate that let me explain this to you my employees are just that hired help and if you are hiring them some of them are here among you they are not my slaves they are all free to make their own decisions as nope. georgie was no nope. what about lily she wasn't free she wasn't given a choice do you really think she wanted if you pay someone to do what you want their lives like that they I'm are sorry, still sorry that your sister asked doing what you told them to do that I decided against my mm. judgment to give her a distasteful job oh my god right and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave mm -hmm. yeah that's mm -hmm. what you did to us how you kept us all you in forget line. it was not me oh. who put you in that position you all act like I'm some kind king. of tyrant. you are the government abandoned you Left you poor and Can we just punch him down into the wishing well? there to look out for you. That's what I was saying last episode. Yes, but, but he was that. also controlling the government. That was Crane. Crane was the one who let this town go to the fucking dogs. The guy who was in your pocket, remember? Yes, Bigby, yes! What about Auntie Greenleaf? Her story is not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homeland. Mm -mm, you can't turn this on us. Anyway. With nowhere else to turn, He's painting himself as the help. good guy. And what did I do for you? You got my tree back. I got her tree back. And in turn, we used her magic to help poor fables get glamours. Because I helped her, she was able to make a living, provide for herself. And what did they do? For the longest time, not much. But they asked me to come work for them. Really? The new deputy mayor wants you on the 13th floor. No. The wolf offered me the job. She wanted my tree destroyed. If she had had her way, I'd be hung out to dry on a clothesline by now. Shit. What? No, 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 no. Why would you no, don't try to manipulate us. You're doing, and it's not going to work. You can't manipulate us or these people. We're not here to talk oh, about this. Oh, we're not? Bigby just this means is that... important, and I'm glad it's being talked about. You know why I asked him to destroy your tree. You were working with Crane and the Crooked Man. Yeah, there were reasons. It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. 
Oh my god. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, and you being too soft to notice what he'd do to get it. It had nothing to do with a crooked man. That's a fine reason to hate Crane. Mistakes. They are not mutually I've exclusive. Made some mistakes. I'm pushing I've you down the wishing well as I well. I want what's best for this town. Wow. Thank you. So, and I believe you. That may not always be clear right away, but I want you all to know that I care deeply about all of you. And so does the sheriff. Yeah, right. I can't promise you perfection. No one can. But I can We didn't get them to send this mess. We're heart. trying to Maybe protect you. I noticed, but we've been doing all this to protect you. We're trying to stop people like him. The crooked yeah. man's been exploiting you. Exploiting your hope for a better life. You would go to him for help. And he would take that weakness mm -hmm. and add it to his strength. He never cared about any really of you. I think the crooked man cared about you. He just cared about your money. He cares about your obedience. He cares about your obedience, your money, keeping him higher in power. You're right. Yes! You're all still we got afraid beast. of him. Even now. Come on. Come on. But Come you on. Need to be. His contamination Come of on, this town Beard. Yes. Is yes! And yes! Will have their justice. Hell yeah! We even got Auntie Greenleaf! <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, damn, dog. Very good. Very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely mm. unfounded. The sheriff simply doesn't have a particle of evidence linking the Georgie board. was working for you. Bigby got a confession, a confession that... that nobody heard. Oh my god. Now, I'm no barrister, but I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke, especially given Bigby's history. What are you talking about? What about so, your history? What about your history? All you've done to this fucking town. What do you mean there's no evidence? Crap. Maybe, maybe he's. I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. God damn it! Why? Of course it's right. This man tormented all of you for profit. Georgie Thank you. killed him. make sure I understand you. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did because he was working oh for my me God. at the time. Yes? Yes. Of course. Yes, yes you are responsible. You're responsible. You paid him. If you I'm told to him to do Georgie's it. Mistakes, shouldn't Miss White be held accountable for Bigby's actions as well? What about my actions? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under my watch. Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that go? Snow Snow wasn't involved. Nothing to do with it. We all thought she was dead. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Mm -hmm. right before he was. You decided to kidnap him. Mm -hmm. It was for his own protection. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So, you won't answer for your employee's behavior, but I must perish for This mine. is completely different. Very I different. I will not order those two girls dead. It simply never happened. God damn it, I Georgie messed up. He's going to get Faith out of this. Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. This isn't right. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Listen, I the know laws apply that's not when true. We need that's I not mean, a true. certain level of privilege should be afforded to three to who? This is how it's always been. Yes. See, this is exactly to what I'm speaking. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world, and ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives <gasps> with the promise of more? Oh my God! Oh my who God! Was there while they idly played in their towers, judging you. I believe mindless children too stupid to command your own destiny without me what who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction who will dare challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens well now that who you will protect you from well if we kill wolf? uh 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 who wolf in sheep's me? clothing Miss White. <gasps> Nessie Nettie excuse me I... let's say you're Nettie <sighs> I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take oh my a God, moment please. to catch your breath? What's wider. she doing here? Let I'd her like speak. To, I, I need to say something. We're kind of in the middle of something. Go ahead. Of course. Go right ahead. You probably don't remember me. 
I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just shut you... up. You enslaved <laughs> yes. us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe mm -hmm. out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. <gasps> but you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. Her lips aren't sealed um, anymore. I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? No. Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some order here. She wanna... wanted you freed from the ribbons. She took her own life. I'm sorry, um, I don't <laughs> think... Nerissa! My name is Nerissa. He didn't even know her name. He ordered them dead. This mm -hmm. fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. <gasps> the only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And now I can finally say... Say it. Worry. He's gonna pay for it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie We're winning the crowd without his say so ever. You're going to take the word of us. Yeah. At least five yeah. other girls will back I me am. up on this. We all heard you say it. Are you kidding? Now. Looks like we found our evidence. <gasps> she saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Yep. Good enough for me. Me too. Down so the wishing right. well Down you go. Well. No, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's got to pay for what he did. Listen I would to throw him down the wishing well. You're all rats. That's permanent, Came right? From one sinking ship to the next. Shut your fucking so mouth. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. Sad. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't let you go free after this. What, what did, did you, you expect? expect to happen here? You're getting what you deserve. Mm -hmm. Well, now for your sentence we don't have to become murderers what are you talking about he's guilty i know that but we don't have to kill anybody we can imprison him lock him up forever somewhere he can never hurt anyone again how can we be sure he where won't escape? i can help we'll use magic that's I not good him. enough Maybe there's only more oh. if he isn't Hasn't stopped been enough i don't get so we get rid of him. i don't even know what to do everyone listen up Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think this we... is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. Why not? I what think Snow should Snow should decide. Should decide what we do with her. She's gonna be the deputy mayor. But so she's not we don't the need deputy a... mayor yet. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. Shit, I didn't want to me. take this I away from died. Snow. Okay. Fine. Are what does sure? Snow want? This isn't how it's, it's what the people want, Miss White. Okay, Mr. Wolf, it's your call. Snow. Just do what you think is right. Yes, Sheriff. I mean, I want to rip his head off, you think but I also want to throw him down the well. Lesson. No. He has to die. We can lock him Just away. fucking get rid of him. Throw him down the well. <gasps> Shit! Bye! There you are. Throw him down. I hope you all what, that big B defended himself? When you try to sleep. Throw you him know, down the well. Just between us, I was gonna let you live. But now... No, absolutely not. Bye, buckaroo. No, I won't. I want Big B to change his perception. I don't want him to turn into the full beast. He's not the full beast anymore. For Lily and Faith. For Lily and Faith. Yes, another one of us to erase from the books. Oh. a sad ending film oh. we have more oh hi 
Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. <gasps> I don't know if you remember me. Oh, Junior. Wait. You've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <sighs> I think I've lost count. Are you gonna come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay. Great. Hmm. This fucking line. Hmm. Shit. Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf, flycatcher left his keys. Uh, can we talk? Listen, Snow, uh, can we talk? I, I won't. No, I, she I'm can't. sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. We'll talk later, okay? Poor Snow. She needs help. She needs, like, more. Good morning, Miss White. <sighs> You're late. What? Bluebeard got to go in there? Someone's gonna see you, Colin. You wink at us, Colin. Oh, Gowan! Jesus! We only have like five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake! I don't give a shit! You forgot these. Oh, thank you. They're it's leaving. It's pretty busy around here. Morning, Sheriff. Wait, we gave you Not money! Day. Wait! Uh, shit! But I tried to help! Down, would you? I'm so sorry. Sorry about all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away, huh? You promised me I'll get another chance. But Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. I told her I had the money, but she didn't want to hear it. That sucks. She's really laying down Sheriff the line. I have something. <laughs> I'm you know, so it was sad. A yeah, I bet. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's no time to say goodbye. So, if you could bring it to her, yeah. she was nice. Yeah, sure. I couldn't take them all with me, and she said she liked that one the best. It's a willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, because when it. they're little, they have these pouches that squirt juice at you if you touch them. I'm sure she'll love Maybe it. Maybe it's not so she bad at the farm. Pretty. We're about ready to head out. What's it like at the farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they eat people in their sleep sometimes. Oh, no. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I really I hope not. I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. I'm, I'm sorry, TJ, but... Uh, there's nothing else I can say. Side, okay? There's plenty of space to run around. Uh, and a nice river nearby, so you can swim all you want. Even in daytime? Yeah. You don't have to worry about the money. Sooner. That's true. The TJ money will be sooner. have like a little more freedom. <laughs> Come on. He won't have won't to hide it. <laughs> have you been there before? No. I'm uh some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves. <laughs> so you wouldn't know, would you? No, we wouldn't. We're all set. Bye, Mr. Wolf. Goodbye, TJ. Bye, TJ. Hey, Big B. Where's your friend, Colin? Where's a fucking pig? Mm. How should I know? Shit. Sorry, Toad. Saying goodbye? Hi. Hi. Oh. Hi. <gasps> Wait. 
you're still wearing them. That was so sweet. Oh, yeah, I guess I am. It's not easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able to. It's just... I understand. Okay, I get it. I kind of wanted to remove it, but I don't know. I don't want to force her to. Listen, I... I came here because I have to tell you something. What is it? It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. Uh-oh, what? I'm not sure where to start. The beginning? <sighs> Faith, Lily, and I, we had this plan. We are gonna find a way out. Leave the pudding and pie for good. Is that why he killed then, them? Faith decided to get some leverage. Mm. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, oh. I... I had no choice. You have to understand. You've seen how they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine the did she they kill Faith? to silence someone who had physical evidence? Marissa, what did you do? I freaked out, okay? I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You, oh my what? god. So I told him everything. And I begged for mercy no. for all of us. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. Georgie didn't Georgie do mercy. Didn't do mercy. You know that. He could have been reasoned with. I was counting on that. Georgie promised he'd Rick. smooth things over with the crooked man. But then, oh God. <laughs> what happened? Can you tell me anything else? Then Faith was killed. I don't know what happened. But that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while the two of us were sitting there, as he was telling me this, Faith walked in. And I had to watch while Georgie... <gasps> Wait, so Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man? Back at the well, you said... I know what I said. But it wasn't the truth, was Shit. it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. She shouldn't have lied, but what's done is done. I'm not going to say anything. I know he ordered their deaths. I wasn't going to let him get away with it because of a stupid technique. Honestly, and I felt Especially the same way. After. after what? That night, after Faith... I tried what? to warn Lily, but she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I... I left Faith's head at your doorstep. Oh. You? I walked her over here, and I left her. So that I would no notice. To get my attention. So you... You started all this. I just pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all the time. The crooked man was counting on that. Yeah, he was. When we suffer, we do it in silence. And the world likes it that way. We just... It's true. ...fade. Like we never existed. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith. Or Lily. What a pointed message. Nobody cares about us. Not really. I'm sorry you had to I'm do sorry, that. Marissa. Okay, I was I'm a little sorry, upset with her for a second, but... It'll be different now. You'll make things right. You and Snow. Apparently uh, not me and Snow. Apparently Snow like no and Bluebeard. It's just not enough for her or anyone. I so just can't true. win with these people. I know it might feel that way, but they need you, Bigby. Both of you. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other and look out for us. You don't see that a lot these days. Snow doesn't really need I'm sure that's not true. I think it might be. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. You knew when to show mercy, and you brought justice to this town. Finally. That was what I was trying to do. Man in, everyone saw who he really was. I still think so we made the right choice there. You did the right I think if he would have, if he would have just been in a cell, we would have had to. And I left Faith at your doorstep because I knew if anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, 
It was you. I hope I've at least done some good here. You've changed this place. For better or worse, Fable Town wouldn't be the same without you. Where are you going, though? Bye. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Thank you. I think she's right, Bigby. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. I feel like we met before. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. Would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. They used to call me the little did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. What are you remembering? Go after her. I'll see you around. Wolf. What the hell? Sixty-eight point six percent of players killed Georgie. Eighty-nine point six percent of players brought the crooked man back alive. Okay, so we're in the majority on both of those. 38%, 38.6% of players threw the quick man. Wow, we're in the minority on that. But there were three choices there, so it's kind of, you know. Did we accept TJ's gift for snow? Yeah, we did. 98.4. Who doesn't? I want to speak to the 1.5 of you that don't. What the frick? What are you doing? You hate tiny toads? You saw that little toad cry and you said, no. Fuck you to the toad. Really? Who are you? Monsters. 54.8% of players said, I hope I've done some good here. Wow. With the four choices there and we were over half. Wow. 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 I want to know if people went after Narissa or not. What an ending. I think we did the right thing by putting the crooked man down the well. I do think that he was largely responsible for a lot of what was going on, even if he wasn't the one actually doing any of the killing or anything, but he was like very much controlling both sides of the situation. And so it was for the best that we ended his reign. And I think putting him in prison would have been too opened up too much possibility for him to come out later or whatever and putting him down the wishing wall was a good stop to it all and and i'm glad that we didn't tear his head off because i don't think that was the bigby we experienced i think we saw like a softer more open more helpful side of bigby that's what he wanted to be the way other people see him is the tearing off of the heads is the is the violence first think later and i think the bigby that we experienced here is violence is useful to sometimes get what you want or to sometimes deal with people when there's no other way to deal with them however listening and talking can also be useful tools and then in the end i played him even a little less violent we didn't there were a lot of options where we didn't choose to hit or go for the punch because he was hurt and there was that one punch we did go for and it was like don't be careful because like you are pretty wounded and so I kind of refrained after that. I don't know. Overall, phenomenal game. I'm incredibly excited for The Wolf Among Us 2. Incredibly excited for that. And I hope you will come back and join me for my experience of that. Uh, starting next week in this slot of, of content, we will be doing um, The Banishers. So that is, um, I believe, a Choices Matter story game. But I'm not entirely sure actually what it is. Uh in terms of gameplay i think it'll be i think it'll be a good good fit for this slot this wednesday slot of content so i hope you'll come back for that regardless uh thank you for tuning in thank you for joining the lip smacker channel it means the world for me to have you here don't forget to hit like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you know when new content drops check out all the links down below of other places you can find me live over on twitch twitter tiktok instagram uh i'm all around and I hope to see you soon. See you in the next one.